A dream that took off from a small home in Lucknow is now headed to space. Group captain Shubhanshu Shukla will soon become India's first astronaut to reach the International Space Station. Take a look at this report for more. Captain Shuks, India's first captain to ISS, reads a poster outside a modest home in Lucknow. This is the house where dreams defied gravity, where group captain Shubhanshu Shukla once studied, silently filled his NDA form and disappeared during his sister's wedding to write the exam that would script his destiny. The sister marriage was in the house and no one knows about not even one person about this kid, this uh, exam is tomorrow and he's going to do that. Next day morning when the Vidai function was going on, each and everyone is screaming, crying. My father was furious at that time. Where is he? And after some time he was coming back, uh, uh, rushing on the bicycle. Born and brought up in Lucknow, Shukla is set to become India's second astronaut to go into space. His mother still sees him as the same curious, innocent boy. So, this achievement is a good for the child. He has been in the whole world and in all places. So, it's a good thing. It's a good thing for people. We pray for him. 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 His father, Shambhu Shukla, shares the moment of immense pride when Prime Minister Narendra Modi presented his son with the coveted astronaut wings. It was the thing that happened to them, the thing that happened to them, and we were also in front of them. It was very good. They told us that they had to do a lot of work, that your children are very good, so it was very good. It was very good. In this particular narrow lane, there is a house of Indian astronaut. This is the lane a typical mohalla of Lucknow and from if from this space if from this area a man can achieve success and the height of a success is not limited to the sky because it has touched the space now from this very street in Lucknow to the stars Shubhanshu Shukla's journey will inspire more youngsters to dream big with Samarth Srivastav, Bureau Report, India Today. And joining me now is my colleague Akshita Nandagopal. Akshita, when will the launch take place now? So there is a delay, yes. How much of a delay, we don't know just yet. It could be 24 hours, it could be 48 hours. I know we're all keeping our fingers crossed that it's a minimum amount of time, but you can never really say with these kind of missions. And for obvious reasons, all necessary steps, precautions need to be taken. Right now, what's playing spoil sport is the weather. Uh, you can see that it's bright and sunny, but don't be fooled by that. June 10th, there's about a 45% chance of rain, which is why SpaceX didn't want to take a chance. Add to that is the fact that there's also very heavy winds, uh, atmosphere winds which is why again SpaceX has decided to push that launch there are two timings being spoken of here Wednesday morning 8 a.m. roughly about 5 p.m. Uh, in India uh, and the second timing is Thursday 7:37 a.m. it could be either on Wednesday or Thursday it could be pushed beyond that as well completely dependent on the weather and no other factor really because if you look at really preparations on ground I was given my uh, media accreditation badge just a few hours ago because it was clear Axiom NASA SpaceX were already to go technically and as far as the mission protocol is concerned everything was put in place they were all ready for takeoff but SpaceX has the final call essentially on whether we're ready for takeoff climatic conditions weather conditions that's something SpaceX decides because launch of course is their area of expertise it's what they are handling but having said that now there is a bit of uncertainty uh, but 
you can't be too careful in these kind of missions, especially considering it's a manned mission. There's no room for error, which is why right now all uh, organizations, whether it's Axiom or NASA, are abiding by the decision taken by SpaceX. You know, interestingly, the first communication actually came from India, from ISRO, that there is a delay. And you had all of these foreign journalists here coming up to us, Indian journalists, and asking us, is there any confirmation because SpaceX hadn't put it out just yet? But now you've got that detailed confirmation from SpaceX that here at the Kennedy Space Center, the launch will take place either Wednesday or Thursday. Will it get pushed further? Well, you can't really say. It depends on the weather gods essentially here in Florida.